Congratulations. Victory in the opening round of the Players' Championship and a very good victory over a tough opponent. Must be over the moon. Yeah, I'm happy, obviously, to win. Um, Jason, James, Jason's a better player than that. I've seen, I've seen what he can do. He can do great things. And um, I think I was fortunate, really, today. I, I think sort of like the fifth leg just before the break, um, whatever I was sitting on, maybe three, five, six. And I think myself, just bang the 180, bang the 140, and I wouldn't get a shot at the 36. And um, I banged the 180, I banged the 140, and I got a shot at the 36. I thought it was handy. But um, no, my double's impressive today. And um, I was sharp. Um, I'd, I'd like to sleep through the night, actually, staying here. I'm not sleeping. <laughs> not sleeping. Do you feel, though, this is a real improvement and you've turned the corner in your game? Because to the naked eye, it looks... The throw looks smoother and you look comfortable on the hockey again. Yeah, the throw, the throw's smooth. I think um, when I played Michael Smith the other day, obviously, in the Grand Slam, um, I missed too many chances. And this is so, so much unlike in a, in a way to the way I feel. Um, look, you live, you learn. And, and we go this weekend. But, but the, main, the main eyes on sort of the World Championships coming in three weeks. I can get me practice. I can get me practice done. And... Um, I can be sharp for them. And I think, yeah, you'll watch me go through that with a lot of ton averages. From the summer where the action didn't look great to now, what have you done? Is it just hard work or have you made some adjustments to yourself that you knew what was going wrong? I think I think the throw hasn't been smooth enough, really. I think I think after I lost my granddad, I never I never really practiced. I never really put enough time in. Um it's only it's only really been the last sort of three weeks where I've been made to practice and made to made to thingy because I've been playing so much and and I'm grateful to be playing the darts and fair play to the PDC and Barry Earn, obviously through COVID and stuff like that 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 I've still got a chance to work. There's a lot of people out there what haven't haven't done a dime or or a day in work and um, I'm very grateful, but. I think for me, it's, it's it's all about ball management. It's all about going up there, practicing, playing, and and when I play regularly, the darts. I have to admit, I can't I can't sort of knock them at the minute. They're coming out of me and nice. Everything's nice, but it will get better. It will get better. Touching on what you said there as well with the world's on the horizon. I know you don't overlook tournaments, but is it hard not to see Alexandra Palace on the horizon, even though you're in at the Rico? Hey, you've only got a. Room. You only really got to mention Alexandra Palace, and it says everything. Do you know what? Yeah, it was my um, my biggest dream to go there, and obviously win it in my first year. And it's so special to me, art. And I did, um, forgive me, but maybe, maybe I am set on that. Maybe I am looking three weeks forward and and think to myself, do you know what? I want a good run. I want a big performance every single game, and I want to do what I know I can do. And um, at the same time, we players' championships this weekend. I've got to focus and I've got to get my head down. Um, but I can't help that smile every time you mention it to me, Phil. Are, are there some demons to get rid of from last year's World Championships in the back of your head? No, not really. I don't think, um, don't don't get me wrong, not not really in a good place. I wasn't practising well at the time. I think I think it all goes on me if I, if I become just before the World Championships and I'm bouncing off my head and thinking to myself, do you know what, I'm putting ton plus averages in for fun. Um, then I'm going to be dangerous. And that's where I'm looking to get. And do you know the throw's not breaking down and, and everything? I've had a problem with my elbow in the past week. I had a bit of treatment of a girl called Katie. She gave me a bit of treatment in the week. And um, I have to admit, it feels so much better. So much better. Rob, congratulations as always, mate. It's great to see you smiling again. Thank you very much, mate. Thank you. Uh, Rob, you talk about that match practice and how much you will be putting in for the world. Do you think... Although you say you're you're looking toward towards Alexandra Palace, there's a chance here to use the match practice that you're getting at the PC Finals. Yeah, definitely. Obviously, um, don't don't get me wrong. I've got to take this tournament first before before we move on. And I think uh, biggest tournament in the world in the world, obviously coming up in a month's time, and um, you can't get that out of your head. It's, it's impossible. Um, but at the same time, I have a job to do here and I'm, I'm enjoying my darts again and, and sort of going up there, starting to feel like myself. I'm not doing, I, did, I, would, I would only say, yeah, I'm probably 80% at the minute, but um, it will get better and it will just all improvement, really. We know how much of a part fans and supporters play 
in darts and especially during your world championship run they were they were excellent throughout is it a not a relief but something that we don't know if it's going to happen yet there's no 100 percent confirmation but is it something that you're looking forward to having fans back in yeah definitely obviously i think I, look you look at any sport on the tv at the minute i think it's, it's very dull watch football no crowd noise with with the pre-manufactured crowd noise and other things like that it's not the same um you can't sort of get that same sort of crowd feeling but at the same time if we could have it back at the darts it absolutely amazing they inspire you they really do All right, brilliant cheers for your time rob cheers mate